cycled past here. Thought about maybe going there. But it was like that. It was all busy. I thought, I can't be fucked with that. Um, went in there. Cycled through. Can I get through there? Probably can't. Eh? Can I? Well, let me cycle all the way. And you go, go. Go, you can do it. Bastard. Said double back. Through the park. Uh, don't worry, I'm going to be playing the game soon. What are we doing here? Sorry, I can get to it this way. This way. Nearly there. I'll cut through this way. Let's cut through this way. Queen's Park's on the right now. Keep going. Now, it came out there on a Victoria Road. And came down here. Looking left and right for places to go. Left and right, left and right. Until I got to there. Transylvania shop and coffee and I got a fucking um, I don't know if it's called a giant chocolate eclair and sat right there and see the two people that own it that started it they are from or at least one of them is because I, I looked them up they are from Transylvania. Yes. They are from the Transylvania area, region, or whatever you would call it, part of Romania. They are Transylvanian. I am Dracula. Oh, it. I am Dracula. Oh, it. It's really good to see you. I don't know what happened to the driver and my luggage and... Well, and with all this, I, I thought I was in the wrong place. I bid you welcome. Bye. Just think, the voice you put on when you do any kind of vampire or that type of thing comes from Bella Lugosi's... Lugosi? His actual accent. No, his Dracula accent. His accent. Listen to them. Children of the night. That's his voice. What music they make. Alright, he's kind of putting, kind of singing a bit, speaking a bit musically. But that's his accent. Remember I played it before? Bella Lugosi. What did I play? What was it? This here? Yes, we finished the picture yesterday. Well, do you start another immediately? I think uh, the next week. You're Hungarian, aren't you, Mr. Lugosi? Yes, I am. Well, I so he's no fate Transylvania. He's not even Romanian. I mean, I'm Hungarian by birth. I'm an American now. Well, why did you leave Hungary? 
political reasons. After the war, I participated in the revolution, and later, I found myself on the wrong side. Oh, that's very unfortunate. What are you studying now? I'm studying now American slang. I know how to say okay, and cats, whiskers, and baloney, and, and how. <laughs> 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 God, <let's stop>. One! <laughs> Very unfortunate. What are you studying? Two! <laughs> I'm studying now American slang. I know how to say okay and cats, whiskers and baloney and. Here we go. And how. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yes, we you say a cigar or whatever it is. Do you start another immediately? I think, uh, Political reasons. You're Hungarian, aren't you, Mr. Lugosi? Yes, I am. What I mean, I'm Hungarian by birth. I'm an American now. Well, why did you leave Hungary? Political reasons. After the war, I participated in the revolution, and later, I found myself on the wrong side. There he is. I didn't take that look. Wrong side, tab, tablet. Brilliant, oh. brilliant stuff. I found myself on the wrong side. Oh. I'm gonna have to look into that. I'm gonna have to look into that. Yeah, I'll get this, man. I'll get this fucking get up here. But you did become a citizen. I think I'll get this fucking get up. This shot, no trousers, no shoes. Maybe start smoking a cigar. But you did become a citizen, didn't you, Dad? Oh, some time ago, I, and I'm very glad and happy about it. I can stay here for good. Mm -hmm. It's very nice to live in a country where people know how to mind their own business. Mm -hmm. There's something else. It's wonderful how how the American people display their sportsmanship. It just seems like a fucking vampire, doesn't it? For good. It's very nice to live in a country where people know how to mind their own business. That! The way he says that, uh, 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 I might mind their own business, it's fucking very Dracula like. I can stay here for good. It's very nice to live in a country where people know how to mind their own business. Mind their own business like that. It's very nice to live in a country where people know how to mind their own business. There's something else. It's wonderful how. Fucking magic stuff, man. What's this? Why is this so important? Well, what was your first mystery play? It was Dracula. Or did the role depress you? Very much. What? It hunted me. I often dreamed of the dead. In the morning when I woke up, I was tired and depressed. Did you see the play? No, I didn't. I'm awfully sorry. But what kind of uh, makeup did you use? Play, did they say? It will be on the picture, I promised you. Oh, I'd love to see it. Play? Oh. Oh, how frightfully weird. It isn't so much a makeup. It's rather expression. Does it mean, does it mean the film? Have you ever been interested in anything outside of your profession? Oh, yes, very much. I like to, to model, to sculpture. My spare time, I like to put my surplus energy. I married. It, the, the sense of that, whatever it was, he was in a he was in a play. I need to hold on. Bell, everybody, this is a Bell Lugosi stream. Bell Lugosi. Hold on. Look at my fucking eighteen. Look at my eighteen. Fucking Dracula! Right. Right, where are they? Play. Play. Right, career. First film appearance. No, no. Um. Broadway. Play. I need to see. 
There it is. Lugosi was approached in the summer of 1927 to star in a Broadway theatre production of Dracula. There you go. It ran in New York City for 261 performances and toured. There you go. There you are. There you are. So it wasn't a play. That's it. Well, what was your first mystery play? It was Dracula. Oh, did the role depress you? Very much. Oh. It haunted me. I often dreamed of the dead. Is he completely making that up? Or, I mean, he's obviously exaggerating that, but there's no way that he means that. There's no main. There's no way that he that this is real. Look, that face. In the morning when I woke up, I was tired, and pressed. Did you see the blade? No, I didn't. Anyway, did you see it? Anyway, let's let's cheer this up. Let's cheer this place up, man. Music was my first love. This is Michael <laughs> Ball. And it'll be my last And this is his new album called Music A collection of his favourite contemporary songs Oh, Freddy with love him. Music, the brilliant new album from Michael Ball I'm going to get that, I'm going to buy that I'm going to fucking buy that, man Buy that CD. Can I get it in vinyl? Oh, wait a minute. Can you get that? Hold on. Michael Ball Vinyl. How do you spell vinyl? Is it, it's that, isn't it? There we go. Let's see it. Oh, yes. Mark, thanks for sub. Yes, mate. Michael Ball is why I give you my subs. Music, brilliant. David and Crawdaddy Davidson, thanks for subs. Todman, thanks for sub. Thank you very much. Wolfie, Jacqueline McCafferty, Ifley and Epcot man, Jordy Sean. Cool Dad, thanks for subs. My Scottish friend keeps calling me a ball bag. Tell your Scottish power parts fucking shite. Teal K, just mod tactical droids. Thanks again, thanks for subs. Grade 2, more like grade bald. Here's to another month, you beautiful big man. Thank you very much. What's that then? One, off time. That's one step at a time. I can hardly read it, but I can see the shape. Look. Wee word, bigger word, weird word, tiny word, bigger word. One step out of time. You can just see it. Or oh, that! I'm not even reading that! I'm reading that. But you see, everybody, this is why I'm better than yous. Yous, where your, 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 your brains work. My brain's really interesting and different. <laughs> Instead of doing the most obvious thing, which is like, you know, it's right there, one step at a time. I look at that and my, my brain, because I haven't looked here because my brain doesn't work properly because I'm different from everyone. I'm very interesting. My brain goes here. Like, I'm going to try and work this out. Instead of like reading it right there, my brain goes, I'm going to try and work this out. And so because my brain's a bit different from, from yours, because I'm a bit different and interesting, I've actually developed a range of skills that that, that 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 you haven't got, which has been able to to read these things. How are you, so, my friends? My friends all say to me, "How are you so good at being able to read things so far away?" I say it's a skill developed from being uh, unique. I was lucky.
loves that horn in the fucking chin, doesn't he? Oh, I get it. I, uh, Michael Ball Christmas. I get what he's doing there. I get it. I get it. It's like he's praying, right? He's got the horns clasped that 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 way, like praying, like that, right? But it's no praying, praying. It's not like that. It's kind of like you know the way you, you you might you might be like that. You know, while while listening to somebody, so it's kind of like that. But it's it's that. It's like a it's like a visual pun. It's like a visual pun. Oh, I suppose I. It kind of looks like I'm praying, doesn't it? Uh, doesn't it? That is semi deliberate, but it's also it could just be me listening to you, your stories as we talk about the year that's passed, and I listen. No, no, no. He's want he's want you to take him back. That's what it is. He could be praying, or he could be at the door, like that. You know, just have to say. I've been an ab ab absolute twerp. I've been a twerp. And then you go like that. All right. Hurry up. Get in. You, you can you can set the table. <sighs> what am I going to do with him? You said you would never take him back. He said so. Has he said he's sorry? He doesn't need to say so. I know he has. We've just got, he just gave me that look. You've got to stop falling for that look. He was standing at the door with a suit. He had a white suit on when he turned up to yours. I he just came for a show. And he just came straight for it. You're a lucky, you're a lucky gal. You're a lucky gal. When a child is born, do, 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 do. You fucking, you alter that, you end up. With that, you alter that, and you end up with that. Ah, uh, somebody said, somebody on Twitter, I can't remember who, tweeted something like, quote tweeting somebody else, best celebrity encounter. Worst one or nicest and rudest. That's what it was. Nicest was, can't remember. Rudest was Michael Ball. And I didn't want to ask. Because I know it'd just be a lot of shite. <laughs> it'd just be a lot of shite. Ferris, thanks for the sub. Thank you very much. Infinite Cranes and Monster, thanks for the subs. Nice one, Pop. Can't hold back. Delboy, Sipi, Niall, Jack, Penvelope. Tootie and David Bond. Ryback, right thanks, thanks for subs. Is there a football player called Totty? I just remember watching some football game once years ago. Totty, pass to Totty. Thingy. Totty, Totty. Frances Francesco, Francesco, Totty. I just remember it. T him Totty, Totty, Totty. I like to sound it because it sounds like a, well, like a totty, a potato. Totty, football. Roberto, 
il tocco da Martina Engola per il capitano solo e il tiro I need to hear Totti getting said Totti ancora capitano no I'm not saying it Get on, mate. No, I want here. So he's good then. This fucking music shite. Good is he? Was he? Very good. Oh really? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get what I want. I'm not gonna get what I want. Totti. I'm not going to give it one. Do you know, I, I thought, I didn't know what he looked like. I just had that in my mind when I, I thinking back. I thought it was like the 80s. So, so he's, he, he was like maybe big in the, I don't know, five years ago. The 2010s maybe, 2000s. I thought he's a fucking 80s cunt. I thought he actually, when I think about him, I thought he looked like I had I had him pictured in my mind as him for um um they would did live as life like a life as life live as life opus him for opus you know the hair or kind of thick at the back. I thought he looked like him. That look there. Can I Sunis? Sunis? Like, hey, look. Opus. Life! I thought he, I thought he looked like him. I thought he looked like him. Dirty! I thought you looked like him. See, that's not actually that thick. It's actually a wee bit thin. I think, but maybe, maybe I'm getting all mixed up because I'm, I'm, I'm also thinking of fucking Maradona. You know that there? That. I didn't think Totti looked like Maradona. See all this? I can do all this. See all this? I can do all this. Watch this. I can do this. Not this bit. See that? Shit, other bits. That. I could do that. I can do that. You, you can just tell. Um, I don't know much about football, but you can just tell football and the actual the a foot football. Was this man's life? I mean, look, look. You could tell, you can just picture him as a child there on the streets of Argentina. This is how he passed his time. This is before the internet. Him and his football. Him and his football. eyebrows on them, man. I could do with, I could do with half of them. Can I, I could do with, you know, it's sort of like um, Liam Gallagher. I could do with a bit of that. I've got fucking knee eyebrows, man. I could do a bit of that. Let me, let me see. No. Let me see no Gallagher's face for a second. Actually, no, you've got to get the younger one. It's all kind of grey now and all. Get 
fucking eyebrow. Look how thick. His eyebrow's like the fucking height of his eye. Jesus. Wait. Wait a minute. You don't want the grey because grey is sort of... It's sort of like the same... Grey is almost like his skin colour as well. So it's hard to see. Look at that. I mean, I've got nothing. I've got nothing. Look. It's like I fucking plucked them. Nothing. Always been like that. Eyebrows tend to make you look a bit better, I think. Fucking hell, man. Jesus. Let's see that. Hell we are. Now we're fucking talking. Now we're talking. Here, he wouldn't get him. Here, he wouldn't get that plucked, nobody or shaved or something. Let's see him these days. Liam. It's all bit. Uh, wait a minute, does he? Even then? No, no, he's got, got the mail. I see. It's hard to tell. He's got the kind of frown. Is it... Is it, is it, is it f I can't tell. Hold on. Is that a bit, isn't it? Is it? Not as much, but... Right. That'll get on with everybody's... I'm sure you are all like... When are you going to play this shite game? LIFE! The game I'm going to show you, live is life. You ain't swearing the same trousers everywhere. This is, is some fucking German thing, I think. Same clays, man. Touring all about fucking Europe in the 80s. They are stinking, man. Hey, Yana. Wonder what it was like to have a big continental hit in the 80s. Just gone about on your tour bus. For that one song. Miming to cunts like this, look. Oh wait. Oh wait minute, his voice is a bit high. His voice is a bit high like this. But he sings out LIFE! LIFE IS LIFE! Yeah, doesn't he sing deep, mind you? It's husky but kind of high when you think about it. Big friend. Oh, big friend, yeah. From Hohen Ross herunter. Gefallen und haben wir die Bänder gezerrt. Bist Oh, he's actually quite fucking high. What am I, what am I thinking though? Is that high? I can't, I can't get that high. See, I kind of get that high. Life! Wie kann man eine Live-Sendung schöner anfangen als Life is life. Life is life. Now. Why? Did you not speak in German? Ich grüß dich. 
Bei dir habe ich ein bisschen das Gefühl, dich hat ein Pferd getreten. Ja. Ich ja. trete nicht, da war ich. Oh, Ray! Ich dachte. Ich dachte, da war slashed. Ich dachte, da war auch keine, like. Right, so they're just, it's just a print. I thought it were, thought it were gaps. Ritt, leider heruntergefallen und haben wir die Bänder gezerrt. Bist obigfallen. Obigfallen, ja. Vom hohen Ross herunter. Aufs Steißbein oder wohin. <lacht> ja, wie ist das passiert? It's fucking mad to speak all these different languages, isn't it? Naja, also das Pferd wollte nicht so, wie ich wollte. Das gibt's manchmal, ja. Das kenne ich auch. Mm -hmm. Und ich bin dann so vorne herunter und leider auf einen... Oh, ich talk about the same, the same stuff. Oh, ich talk about the same stuff. What was I watching? I remember, I remember saying this before. I was watching some program, uh, maybe a film, and it was in German or Dutch, uh, no Dutch, uh, Danish or something like that. I can't remember. Maybe it was, I don't think it was South Korean. I don't know. There's folk in it and they were yapping away about something and they were talking about, like, nothing. Usual just sort of, like, nothing stuff. I, I don't know, but it's a kind of, like, small talk sort of thing in an office or something. I, and I, I remember thinking, look at that. All these different languages all around the world and everybody's just talking about the same old kind of... It's not criticism or anything like that. All talking about the same mundane, normal... We things, but using different words. Malwurfshügel aufgekommen und von herunter. Wann hat's angefangen mit Opus? Na, das weißt du am besten nicht. Das yeah. weißt du sofort. You know, you talk about things like that fucking thing isn't it working again? I don't know what's wrong with. Have you phoned them yet? Ah, uh, I don't know. I'll maybe get on it like that. But in um. Turkish. Afro, Afro, uh, and beneath the headphones, sings the subs and bits. Blur o or Oasis. For me, Oasis, but I was never real in it either. But I uh, prefer Oasis. Ferka sings the sub. That's right. The Seven Years Dry video, noon, 19 years. I used to do drugs, sings the bits. My... Absolutely 100% genuine girlfriend is in hospital trying to give birth, but the baby's been stubborn, right? You could do some of your funny man stuff to make her laugh and speed the process. Here. <laughs> I'll get a wee chuckle. I hope that helps. <laughs> Banco's toast thinks the sub. Shout out to the best mod, Mary Biscuits, not only holding this place together, but also another completely unrelated online community. Um, I give no shout outs to specific mods. It creates division within uh, the mod community. It's a shout out to Mary Biscuits and every other mod equally. You see, Banquist Toast, you don't realise that you've probably acted against Mary Biscuits by getting a shout out. And that's how I know my stuff. Because you wouldn't know that. You think you're doing a good thing, you're doing a bad thing. It takes having years of experience in a sort of line of work to know. Because then, you know, it becomes a target. Things like that. Some kind of get banned for here and they go, fucking mods. Do you know what? I bet it was that and then the only name they kind of remember, Mary Biscuits. It'll probably be that fucking Mary Biscuits one. Ferris and Infinite Cranes. Monster, thanks, thanks again. Fat Old Pixel. Thanks to, thanks to subs. Sign language is different in most countries and can even have regional variations in the same country. I can understand that just because it came about in the same way as um, the lang uh, language itself, but I suppose there's, there's no fucking need. I don't know. Or maybe. I don't, I don't know exactly. I don't exactly know how sign language works. Like I don't know. Is there any signs that are the way that it signed like that because it sounds like something else, so it's meant to be like something else, and it's only like that something else because it's similar, a similar word or something in that language, but not in another language or something. I don't know. 
I want to be alone for me anyway. My hearing's fucked. My hearing's fucked. I was thinking about going for a hearing test the other day. Not going in for the test the other day, but I was thinking, honestly, see the other day, the amount of times I was like, that, to Daniel and Lynn, what? 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 Like a third time. It's just all kind of muffled. It's not, it's not pure muffled enough. I've been to the doctors twice, three times even. Fine. Nothing, there's nothing inside the looking, nothing's up, it's no wax, it's no, oh, I can see you've got a fucking, uh, a cotton bud, a cotton bud that's snapped half in there. It's just them. Um, I've always been like this, I always remember, in pubs when I was younger, can hear a fucking thing any cunt was saying. I just remember, I'd be right next to people, and they could hear each other even though they were at a greater distance apart. And I'm I'm close to them and I kinda make out what they're saying. You know about like we're but uh, just a slight bit of noise, but of music and a motor if there's too much I can't I can't fucking hear. In Mainz, bei auf los geht's los. Und uh, mit was für einer Nummer? Was war das noch damals? Flying high, flying high. Flying high. Einen Höhenflug hat Opus begonnen. But uh, life is life. Ever. Let him go for fuck's sake. He sang his song. Well, he's mind it. But in a moment, ganz Europa. Ja, das ist richtig. Also wir sind in allen europäischen Ländern erschienen und wir Dann wünsche ich, dass der Höhenflug weitergeht und dass es nicht so kommt wie so oft, dass um, Höhenflug möglicherweise eine etwas harte Landung, sondern ich hoffe, dass der Höhenflug weitergeht und dass wir uns vielleicht in drei Jahren Immer noch da oben irgendwo im Wolkenkopf. Is, is this an interview or a fucking monologue? Let the guy ask a question. Let, he's the one. Sam, mit einer neuen Riesennummer, ähnlich wie Life is Life wiedersehen. Ja, ich glaube, der Höhenflug wird sicher anhalten, zumindest bis zum 29. Juni. Toi, toi, toi. Wiedersehen, what does that mean by itself? Wiedersehen, what does that mean by itself? Not auf Wiedersehen, but auf Wiedersehen. Is it again? Does it maybe mean again? See it again? Or is it like Vida? It's like. Muss man ein bisschen Reklame <laughs> angehängt werden? Ja, Graz, genau, Open Air. Ein großes Open Air haben. Alles Opus Gute. Und Freunde werden dort auftreten. Bis dahin. Alles Gute. Opus! Thanks. Bye for now. Well done. Global hat. English, please. English? English interview? No. Hard though for Opus 3. No, it's not happening. It's not happening. Right, that's us. LIFE! What was that? Where was that other one? See, German. Spanish, maybe, um, pa pa French, Patrick Hernandez. That's cunt. That's cunt. Oh, there he is, yeah. Jerry Sandowitz. Jerry Sandowitz. Careful, careful. Jerry Sandowitz. There he is. There he is. Madonna used to be a backing dancer for him. Aye, this song. Pete Doherty.
Right, I don't, I'm going to get on with the game now. Too loud. Uh, too quiet, sorry. Far too quiet. Far too quiet. Just crap video. Crap video. Bonjour, je suis Patrick Hernandez, le chanteur de Born to be Alive. Aha, Patrick Hernandez. What were you thinking? American? Spanish? Wrong. Mexican? Bonjour, je suis Patrick Hernandez, Wrong. le chanteur de Born to be Alive. Wrong. Le musicien était belge, l'arrangeur était belge, donc c'est quelque part un produit belge. Je suis le seul français de l'histoire, finalement. Mm -hmm. Qui est sorti et a eu un succès immédiat. Et devant le succès que nous avons... Who was that just thinking, just a wee second ago? Who was that thinking, now? Patrick Hernandez... Spanish... French... Hernandez... Who was that going to look up? Oh! Oh, I that, because I looked at American Bandstand. He's shy. Shy. You? 19. And you? 20. And you? Uh, you feel, oh, isn't that shy a pitiful prince. case? 20 next week. Right. 7. 21. Right. 15. 18. All right. You're all in the general area of age of this man you're about to meet. The lady we talked to in the last half hour, sir, when she was three years old, several years ago, this man... Hey, sorry. Uh, ...when he was a teenager, a, uh, a in the last half hour... January 26, 1980, and this up here says 16th of December, 79. Oh, for fuck's sir, sake. when she was three years old, several years ago, this man made, uh, when he was a teenager, a uh, demonstration record, made a couple of them... <clears throat> Muted. 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 Right, the whole performance is muted. I'm gonna I'm gonna play um I'm gonna play um I'm gonna play there's a horror game coming right up. You learned to do this in Minneapolis. Where? <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is not the kind of music that comes from Minneapolis, Minnesota. No. <laughs> Would you be kind enough, sir, please, to introduce oh, me to Let's like start that. with the bass player. Oh, he does not like sir. that. Andre Simone. Andre. <laughs> the man who escaped behind keyboard. Matt Fink. Nice to see you. Man on uh, drums. Bobby Z. And the gentleman over here. Des Dickerson. And lastly, on keyboards, Gail Chapman. Hello, Dale. Nice to have you. I don't know you, Gail. I know everybody else. Let's sneak over here, saying, I said there's something, uh, something about the. Uh, bass player. I might know him. He co wrote. Do me, babe, I think maybe. The fact that you I made a couple of demonstrations in records when you were a teenager. You, you're barely more than that now, are you? 19. 19. Well, you got another year to go before you graduate. How many years ago did you, did you make these demos and then uh, have offers on them? And why would you turn it down? Oh, pure shaking. So. Everybody, I do apologize. I've probably, I played this probably about six months ago. I just did my loop, my six month loop. Before you graduate. How many years ago did you. Did you make these demos and then uh, have offers on them? And why would you turn it down? Um, they wouldn't let me produce myself. You were 15 at the time. Yeah. Would they think you didn't know what you were doing? Don't know. Were you ever disappointed that you didn't let them do that to you? No. Did you produce, did somebody tell me you played Just every like instrument this. on this album? Is that correct? Maybe. No, that's it. You're very shy, modest. How many, how many instruments do you play? Mm. Thousands. Moments will be with you. Thousands? No. Literally, do you play all the instruments? Um, a lot. If that is the case, then, oh, I know. If you're out traveling, then you've got to have backup people. Are these people the ones that travel with you? What are your plans for travel? Uh, we have a tour coming up uh, in a few weeks. 
I will look forward to it. We thank you all very much for joining us. What's the name of the next song? Why you want to shoot me so bad? All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Prince. Well, he didn't like that. He didn't like that. He didn't like that. He didn't like that. The media sort of came back to me, and they're focusing on uh, what we're doing. It's pretty hard to ignore. I'm, uh, the audience has never gone away. And didn't like that. Find uh, so much peace here. He didn't like that. Uh, but very rarely, because we uh, work on new music all the time. I'm always writing. He's never, never like, never liked it. Never liked it. Never liked it. Anyway, Ali Stars, Chino, Craig, Trevor thinks the subs. I'm gonna get the game. I'm gonna get the game started right now, so you can be, so you can go. At, is he means it this time, right? Right. Okay. I miss him, even when I'm with him. I see him, even when he's not looking. A few days after that, I visited the library again. A bit more people than before, and among them was Brian. It's not worth a bother, but seeing a major skank's boyfriend bud wandering around in a library is uncanny by anyone's standard. So she's becoming, this Sam's becoming obsessed. This is her first becoming obsessed with me. He must have been there to pick the book for Miss Lasley's assignment. I almost got too close to him trying to see what he was going to pick. I really hope he didn't notice that. I'd rather be known as a regular geek than a creepy one. So she's thinking to herself, oh, I'm a pure geek, me. I'm in the library all the time. I change school. I don't get on with anybody. I'm not interested in these uh, these jocks. No, as in this jock, you know, Scottish, but, um, you know, like quarterback, American football and all that. But one of them, this one called Brian, is actually in the library and she's thinking to herself, actually, he might he might be alright. I might be able to have my cake and eat it. I might be able to get a guy that's like a pure quarterback and all that. But he's also a bit of a geek. I could maybe approach him and say, Oh, that book's really good. That that's what's going on here. That guy vanilla, Farfa. Kiko Flame thinks the subs and bits. Do you like aubergine? I don't actually. Cutting my months like the Mason Perfect Dancer, fucking brilliant dancer. Fucking brilliant dancer, man. Oh, bells, Oh, bells. Woe is me. Hate to admit, but seeing Brian at the library was today's only diary worthy event. Probably because it's the only human interaction that didn't give me the sensation of someone talking behind my back. So this is like how Carrie feels about the uh, the, the boyfriend of the, the all right boyfriend of the all right lassie. Who, by the way, she was fucking laughing, I know. Was she? I can't remember. Was she? No, it was the teacher that was laughing. No. No, that. This. They're all going to laugh at you. They're all going to laugh at you. No, she wasn't laughing. She wasn't laughing. She didn't laugh. See that teacher who was nice to carry her there? He was alright. Spoilers. Sorry if you've not seen the 1976 uh, film Carrie, everybody. This might be a spoiler for the 1976 film based on Stephen King's very first published, uh, well, hit 
kind of novel. His first uh, major novel. Sorry if it's a bit too soon. Spoilers are timeless. I'm sorry, but some things are going to get fucking played. That's a spoiler, by the way. If anybody is thinking, I was just about to watch it the night. That's it. She gets shoved out. Get out. See what you just saw there? See that? That's real liquid. I bet you, I bet you any money and I'm going to watch it. See the fucking remake? Which will probably be pish. Of course it'll be pish. I bet you when the blood comes down, this is pig's blood. When the blood comes, I bet it's CGI. It's like some it's real and some it's CGI. I bet you there's a splash that goes on the camera and all that shit. I thought it was okay. I bet peeve. I mean, I don't know you, but what would you fucking know? You probably think it's better. You probably think it's fucking better than this. That one for the blooper wheel. We're all gonna laugh at you. We're all sorry, Cassie. We're all sorry, Cassie. Trust me. Yeah. You can trust me. Is she really laughing, or is Carrie picturing it? She is, isn't she? The nice teacher, the nice one. Pitching it, nah, she's fucking doing it. She's pitching it, nah, she's no. Uh, pitching it, we saw her at the door. Aye, then she came back. It's on her head. How do you know that? You don't know that. Trust me, Carrie. Trust me. Trust me, Carrie. Trust me. Can get on my. I see that again. Wait a minute. See that? See that there? It's great. I don't get that in fucking films these days. It's not even a. It's not even a pure brilliant film. I don't like. You just don't get things like in films these days. You just don't. You just don't. See that? Look. See that? Just don't, just don't get that. Just don't get that these days. Just don't get that these days. Does anybody have 
Does anybody here have revenge fantasies? I swear to God, see when I was wee, see this sort of thing, I would fucking love to have done things like this, man. Love to have these fucking powers, man. It's part of the good for her genre. Ah, good for her. Yeah! The teacher! The nice teacher! You can get them on it. They all deserve it. They all deserve it. That's not good enough. That's not good enough. She started the laughing and all she gets is what uh, what's that? She banged her head and maybe is getting a bit drowned with a hose? No. No no. Him though. I like the way he goes. Is it the pair of them actually? Fucking squish can't. Die the fucking weapons. Get them all electrocuted. Anyway, right. Get them all can't. Get them all. Right, I'll get back to the game. Butter! That's what she... she laughed! She didn't laugh, she fucking did! She smiled! She smiled! Nah, I think Carrie actually became evil. What is evil? What is evil? You? And what, what am I though? Fucking into them all, get them all fucking burnt, drowned, electrocuted the fucking lot. Burnt alive, man. Burnt alive. Get the door shut, Carrie. Get the door shut behind you there. Door shut behind you. Get open. Get open. That's it. Good. I needed to see that. Right. Here goes Kai. Look, I'm playing this because you tweeted about it. No cunts think of breaking the door down. They can't because she's keeping it shut. She's telekinetic. Astrakal, uh, Liam. You're right, the new version is utter shite. Ted Rogers goes, thanks, thanks to subs. Been subscribing for a long time. My friends, they say, they've never seen me so happy. Liquid Sid and Cut Cudbles. Johnny, it's a smooth. Thanks for subs, Carrie's just like me for real. Listen. Let me just see it, right? Um, I Hopefully this isn't going to be gory because I've never actually seen it. But Carrie... Um, 2000 and two, 2013. Promising, right. I need to see this. I mean, look! Right, hold on, hold on. It's not going to be too gory, is it? Should be all right. The blood's too dark. I'm no, no. Sorry, right, actually. Ain't too gory. Ah, oh, it's nothing you want to get in a, a game. Right, here we go. Too bad. 
Ah, uh, you can see, you can see there, look. I mean, look at that, look. Look, look at that. I don't know if you can see that. Look, our hair isn't, isn't even getting moved. So, look. All right, it's kind of hitting the... But look, it comes down. Battles against the back of heat. She has not moved an inch. Look. Look at that. Whereas with the other one, it's like she's got fucking hit. You know, it's like it fucking hits her. No reaction. And then, you know, kind of like something. You know what? Look pure clear. There. This. Look at how the light bounces off it. And look at look at this, look. Hitting his jacket, look. Oh, perfectly. Oh, fuck off, man. There we go, everybody. It is now completely dried. It is now completely dried. So that's it, dried now. This is the makeup department went, right, so this is the one, right? So this is, you're going to look like this and all the, or, or the press stuff or this, you know, this is, this is the look. So we're going to have a bit here and then this down here. And th then that's all going to be dark in there. So it's going to be kind of light. And that's going to be dark. Perhaps it could be a... It could be symbolic. Look, look, look. A wee bit of fake in this air, look. Dripping from there. To there. It's just all perfect. It's all perfect. So absolutely perfect. What the hell? Ah 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 Perfect, perfect, like you know, that coming down there, space, that coming down there, space, there, space, it's all line, line, line. Right, so they can't laughing at that because they've just Wait, she, she's a witch. Right. I'm gonna laugh at you. I'm gonna laugh at you. I see. Are you seeing this? Right off, man. String a bell and Astro, Liam. Thank you very much. Thanks for the subs. 
the original's not perfect either. But uh it's just some fire and a, and a, a daft hose squishing people and things like that. But um, it's got a feeling to it. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Right, let's get back into this now. Right? Uh, right, so so the the this um, American football jock sort of guy in, in college... Disney sort of like them all. She's a bit of a geek. But this one, one, one of them, called Brian, is in the library. This is a letter for, this is her taking a wee note, a wee letter for the past. A wee diary entry for the past. Was me, hate to admit, but seeing Brian at the library is to the, 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 Why? Seeing Brian at the library was today's only diary worthy event, probably because it's the only human interaction that didn't give me the sensation of someone talking behind my back. At least today's entry was a tad more meaningful than what I wrote yesterday. I need to revise my book options now. Write you later. Love, Sam. A jock in a library? Now I've seen everything. Oh, I... I miss him even when I'm with him. I see him even when he's not looking. And one day, he will start looking for me too. Only to realise I was with him the whole time. Like a boogeyman under a sleeping child's bed. The term boogeyman got mentioned in this house once and I was fucking... On it like a set in a fucking split second. Bogeyman. We say the bogeyman here. We don't say the boogeyman. Look at this. The bogeyman film. Look, the boogeyman. No, 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 that one. Right, so 1980. 1980. The Boogeyman. Right, that one there. I remember seeing the cover for it. Right, in America they had it as the... That, I remember that was in the back. The back cover of the fucking video. But we called it... The one that was released here was the Boogeyman 1980. Where is it? Where's that fucking... That there, man. Saw that in the video shop. 1980, so I was like about six. And the fucking back cover. VHS, give me the VHS. VHS. There it is. Give a second. Can I show you that? Well, look at this. This is what I picked up when I was, uh, like, about six. Cover there, look. Fucking tied up, rake through the fucking neck. Scissors to the neck and all this fucking stuff. Horror film thing. That's me, video shop like that, when I was wee. I didn't watch it, I've never seen it. So I would have been about six, maybe seven. Maybe I've been sitting there for quite a while. Video nasty, it's not video nasty. Picking up and... And uh, looking at it, you know, turning around. room. Guy with a rake through his neck. Woman looking up with scissors to her fucking throat. There was another one called... I think there was one called... Uh, it was maybe My Bloody Valentine or something like that. It was something like that, I remember, at the back. It was like, I, I, if I remember correctly, it was like uh, a tit or something with blood scushing it. It was something like that. Look, that is a wee boy like that. 